Hey, welcome to vba-tutorialcode.com. In this video lesson, I'll show you how to get by the procedure too large. You can link two modules together in VBA, so there's no limit to how many uh, modules you can execute with one single click. Uh, I find the procedure too large always appears whenever I'm building a complex program. And see how many lines are up here? There's about like 3,000. Whenever you have more than 3,000 lines of code, Excel gives you an error called compile error procedure too large and that's just because there are too many lines of code executing in this module so what I like to do is I like to link a second workbook uh, I just open it up and then I run uh, the module from the first module so I open up the second workbook and I run the second workbooks module from the first workbook and I just add I link the two workbooks together basically through VBA and uh, that's so once you hit 3000 lines of code you just link the second workbook to the first workbook and then you can run 3,000 lines of code from that workbook, and you can do that forever. Uh, so I'm just going to delete about like like 20 lines of code here. So there's only like 2,975 lines of code here, as you can see in workbook one. There is uh, on sheet one, there eight range A1 is blank. Uh, that's because the procedure was too large, so none of this code executed. All this code here is it just makes A1 value equal to one. So I'm just going to press play and it just executed so range a1 equals 1 now but uh, yeah so now I'm just going to link uh, the second workbook to this workbook so I'm gonna run everything up till here up till here and right here this opens up the workbook here's the file path of the workbook and then here's the file name of the workbook concatenated together so I'm just gonna press play now and it's gonna actually open up workbook 2 and then I'm gonna show you the code inside workbook 2 all right, so it opened up workbook two, and here is the module in workbook two. It's called sub second module, and let's go back to workbook one now. Double click here, and what this code, this line does right here, it says application dot run workbook two dot xlsm and second module. So what it does is it runs inside of workbook two, right here. It's gonna run the module name exclamation point second module. So it's going to run this code right here that I just highlighted, second module. It's going to execute this module from the first module. And at the end of it, it's going to activate workbook one, and it's going to make range B1 equal to this value right here. As you can see, right now only A1 equals one. So I'm just going to step through this final line of code, and it's going to run the second module code. Now I'm going to press F8 right here. And uh, you, as you can see, it linked right to the second module in workbook two. I'm gonna press F8 again, F8 again, and F8 again. So now range B1 actually has value from second module, and that's from the second module. So as you can see, you can go past 3,000 lines of code. There is no limit. And let me just run that all over again. So. I'm just going to close out of workbook two. I'm just going to delete this and I'm just going to press play. All right. So as you can see, everything executed from the first workbook and the second workbook. Thank you for watching my video. Check out vb 8 tutorialcodecom for more lessons.